hey guys welcome back to our youtube channel today we'll bring to you just on Mori Lee. yes the one and only for me awelewa just a few weeks ago for me awelewa made rounds on the news and of course it was a controversial word recently she posted on a social media page letting everyone know that whether you hide your relationship or you show it on social media relationship will go spoil go spoil but then it is left to you to decide she did say this directly she shared a post which says that i'm hiding my relationship from social media and she added a caption saying na so lol alongside this post she shared was a picture of herself and the boo and several other photos expected our fans and followers reacted some people praised that some people hailed that some people advised that in their own little way post she shared online reads and i quote i don't bring my relationship on social media i keep my relationship secret even the person i'm dating doesn't know we are dating i don't trust you people and she added a caption which says nah so lol but people have been attributing this post back to for me awele wa mistakenly went on live video but she didn't know she didn't notice and it was heard on the ground where the guy this guy in question her boyfriend or husband was raining curses on her and immediately she realized she was on live she quickly ended the video and this made a lot of her fans question if she was in an abusive relationship if she's okay if she's on the duress typing some of the things that she's typing and so many things well this news made rounds on social media and the popular blogger called Gislova shared on social media that karma hits differently why is the word karma used in this case is because Fumi Awelewa was alleged to have snatched this man who was heard on the ground cursing her in the video shared online from another woman this was the reason why the popular blogger called Gislova used the word karma eventually Fumi Awelewa responded and said she's not in an abusive relationship people should stop asking her question and they should let her be responding to her fans and followers she said after this post if you ask me about anything walai ikile magba because i just started putting my life in shape last year was tough that i couldn't attend a lot of events plus locations i didn't see anyone i was all alone with my predicament i spent more than i earned on hospital bills and drugs yet i'm still smiling only few colleagues friends reach out to my family i am grateful god didn't put us to shame for the record i am not in any abusive relationship and i can never lower my standards for such i am not worthless classless and trust me no man can turn me to an object of ridicule if such happens i will opt out without thinking twice please edakon enough of mbatin bati i need full concentration to take care of this old woman don't stress me with are you sure feel free to believe what you read and leave me alone assume and quote the swords from Yawele were responding to everyone who has been asking her if she's in an abusive relationship that she went on live video and the young man could be heard cursing her calling her terrible names here is the post from the popular blogger called Gistova which sparked a lot of reaction on social media and made a lot of people ask her if she was in an abusive relationship before she responded says and I quote hello twe twe karma came so quick hello twe twe so yesterday i was generally chilling on the street of instagram now so i see notification of live video from our auntie for me more really now so i carry my two left legs during the live video the live video was short and she did it on her way though immediately she realized she was live she ended it immediately for the live video this yahoo boy we call himself more really husband was beating her and cursing her parent you can hear the struggle from the video. The guy said in Yoruba, Abi ko fed da fa won to niye. Abi, you know one better for those we bond you. We know see and pass that one no. He pay me sha, but thanks to Kama for coming early. For me, Mori Lee, slide to the second picture, Biko. You remember this gist then, and I promise you say you go meet your own for front. Few years later, you later jam Yahoo boy, only 100 items. Wait on you to punch him back this woman cried out to me then you took her husband car deprived the husband from going home to see his family i still have the pictures of the torn uniform where the wife of tola sent to me then their kid is going to school in turn uniform for me they leave la vida local the woman cried tired that time now come and don't hold your two breasts 
they show you pepe nollywood yeah british we snatching be on a logo serial home breakers hand go touch on a one by one it go reach on a round i come in peace now so them turn for me to punch in bago i think say now for only movie them they beat them she chop beating for real life too and to you women beta uloju wonko omo ale kitty and go touch you too she be na efcc i tag you too then na interpol i go tag you for you now only 1000 itunes is on ige we do ni wukba wow note associations of the bunkers debunky and when your mom fa only debunking una free to do follow follow to deny you na una we shall no stay there making key you finish before you move end quote this was the post that triggered the response from morelli and of course our consent fan after seeing this recent post still went ahead to ask a few questions if she was okay and if this man was not going to break her heart the fan said and i quote i hope that guy no go break your heart you too like him you're my fave anytime anyway and she responded by saying god no go she must jerry i'm not perfect neither are you make person just they enjoy the moment they go yolo this was marie lee responding to a concerned fan if she was making the right decision staying with this young man marie lee was once been called to other over this matter of her having an affair with this young man before it now degenerated to the beating and cursing level which was mistakenly shared on her social media page and for me i responded saying that she didn't know this man in question was married it was the same popular blogger called this lover who called her out back then sharing a picture of the wife the young man in question and for me a caption followed the saying the woman is always in my dm when i reached out to you to stay off the man you said you were not aware he is married okay fine you know no how about when the wife called you several times to allow the guy to take care of his kids to please release the husband the wife is always crying but then she said she wants to remain anonymous anonymous bow i can't fight your battle while you are hiding no this battle will fight them together ne? even when you collected the husband's car the wife came to cry to me in the dm let me even go and look for the ladies and do them come tag you for ordinary picture you the yandos a big shift that aside the snitching way they your body no be here hear from this one tell the other one now them i beg i come in peace jerry i eat rather rather this was the initial post shared by the popular blogger calling Fumi Awelewa out. Fumi Awelewa went ahead to sue this popular blogger called Gislova for defamation of character. But of course, we all know that. Find the true identity behind the user of the blogger is hard and no one has been able to do that. Well, we hope that truly, truly, Fumi Awelewa is not in an abusive relationship. And if she is, we hope and pray that she gets the right help that she needs and not trying to suffer in silence well guys stay happy do not forget to like subscribe drop your comment in the comment section below thank you bye